Under low slung and gray skies, the lines of visitors continue to steadily stream inside Manila Memorial Park in Sucat, Paranaque. But the crowds this year are significantly less, letting a combined team of management personnel, soldiers and police and community volunteers ensure a more controlled and orderly observance of All Saints Day this year. PTV correspondent Alan Francisco on the dozen thousands that have come and gone this day and the expected surge tonight with increased vehicular traffic inside in this report. Every year, Josie makes sure her family visits the tomb of her husband at Manila Memorial Park in Sucat, Paranaque. And every time they visit, she can recall the promises made to their children. Magkaroon ng magandang ano, kinabukasan, mapag-aral ng maayos. Like Josie, a lot of people also celebrate Dia del Muerto at Manila Memorial Park. The management of the Memorial Park, PNP, AFP, Barangay and volunteers have been coordinating with one another to ensure the safety of visitors and clients. Generally, masasabi ko, uh, peaceful. So wala po, po tayo ng uh, rip, mga untoward incident na na-report. Hindi po natin hinahaya magpasok ng deadly weapons o mga matatalim na bagay. Hindi po rin natin na-allow yung mga flammable uh, air, uh, materials. At the gate, strict and tight security has been implemented. Prohibited things are checked in and left at the gate claim upon exit. For security, ay sa mga problema. Para sa amin din yun eh. Is lower traffic is expected tonight. A lot of vendors are taking the opportunity inside the memorial. Some were confused where their relatives have been laid to rest, but with help and determination located them eventually. Meanwhile, famous personalities like the couple, former President Cory and former Senator Nino Aquino, were also visited by their supporters. While Rikuyan's fans also showed up to pray and remember him. Mabait sila, maganda yung ano nila noon. Marami pa siyang dapat matulungan, maging, mo maging model siya ng mga ibang kabataan. From Paranaque City, Alan Francisco for the Nation.